So I've just attached the black and we're going to yarn over and go through, yarn over and pull through two, pull through two. And we're going to repeat that last again. One more row of the black. However, this is the last row of that. I will show you where to go now. So we've done that, you want to do one chain to turn, this counts as nothing, and then you're going to go along the next five with a double crochet, and into that last stitch we do a little bit different. So we're just going along with a double crochet in each stitch. There we go. And into that last stitch, you want to do two double crochets. So that's one. And back into that same stitch for two. Now this is where we start to create the foot of the boot. So, single chain down and we're going to go into that stitch again. And you're going to do another two double crochets into that stitch. So there's one and back into that for two. And then you're just going to crochet one double crochet along into the remaining stitches. So there we go. Into the next chain or stitch. And into the next one for a double crochet. And just continuing this along. So, last one, yarn over, go through the stitch, yarn over again, pull through, pull through two loops, pull through two loops. And into the next one, you want to chain one. You're going to go back into that stitch for a double crochet and continue this along to the last stitch. And into that last stitch, you'll do a double crochet. And you will do three double crochets into that stitch total, so another two. One, and two. That's three double crochets into that stitch total. And now, what you want to do is chain five. One, two, three, four, and five. So, chain five, and into the second chain from hook, you're going to slip stitch into it. So pull through, 
and pull through again. Into the next chain, you want to do a single crochet. So go through, pull through, pull through, base. Into the next, you want to do a half double, so yarn over, go through, yarn over again, pull through, and then pull through all three. Into the next and last chain, you want to do a double. So yarn over, go through, pull through, pull through two, and pull through two. And that creates the little point on the boot. So now into the next stitch, you want to do three double crochets. and three and then you want to do three treble crochets so yarn over twice go through yarn over again pull through pull through two pull through two and pull through two so you want three of those so another two here we go and through two and through two and through two yarn over twice go through pull back through through two through two and through two. In and you can see that just helps bring that peak round. Into the next stitch you want to do another treble crochet through two, through two and through two and into the next stitch another treble crochet into the next stitch a double And into the next stitch a half double. So through three. Into the next two, you want to do a single. So there's one. And into the next stitch, another one. And into the last three, you want to do three trebles. So next stitch, it's one treble. And into the next stitch another treble and into the last stitch for your last treble and that creates the heel on the boot so now you have finished you pull up your loop and you can cut and that is the main body of your boot. So now you just want to sew in your ends and I'll meet you back for the next part. And there you have it, that 
that is the end of this tutorial. Once you've created your boot, you can block it the way we did the cauldrons. So you put it face down onto your blocking mat, pin it in place. It's quite nice to pin the little tip so it curls a little bit more, it just helps it sit nicely. You glue the back and once that has dried, you can attach it to your bunting. This is the end of my three part series for my witch collection. But please do, as I said earlier, subscribe, like the video, comment down below if you have any questions, and I will see you all in my next video. Thank you, bye bye.